the Dear Little Movie. Way long ago, it was all, there was not that all, but peace in, in the grasslands and forests. Just animals being their normal selves, playing with toys, reaching up to trees to find leaves. Running around and chasing the gazelles that they, that, that are their friends. Chasing around their friends, playing hide and go seek. And you know, just being friends. Ugh. One day a long time ago, One day, a long time ago, something happened that changed the whole area. Cookie Deer's dad left her when she was only just a little girl. She would wait hours and hours for him to come back, but he was way off the side, all the way to in the ice, playing around and having different friends and, and different family. Family than her. She would get judged in, in, a, in school for not having any parents because her mom left her to go to go on the best vacation, but then she never returned. That's what happens when, when her parents go on vacation. Because they always want to stay there for forever because, because the hotel rooms are so cool because their parents were, her parents were rich. What are you, just an alone rich girl? Lost. We don't want to to listen to you anymore and judging us what to do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, girl. You you don't even. Your parents don't even have cutie marks. <laughs> you look like you're a My Little Pony because you have a cookie on you. Like your name is Cookie Pie. <laughs> Climb up a tree, and I'm too tall to even reach one. <laughs> oh, hey guys, what do you have to do if if you got judged over in in here? Fifth grade too. Yeah, hey, I am too. Me too. I guess I'm the only second grader in here. Yeah, because you're so small. Ah, that's rude. She's in fifth. She's in fifth grade too. Go there to death grade too. Yes, you're picking her. I'm beating her up. I don't like fifth graders thinking they're so rich. Now who's next in this race of me people be beating up the fifth graders? Hey! <laughs> that was Isabella. She doesn't like fifth graders because she's too small to even see them, to see even see their faces. She would have to jump off to jump up to see us. And all she could see is our hooves. 
and sometimes gun goes under us because because they think it's gross to be able to see someone's butt. It is gross. She just looks around to try to punch us in the face, even though even though we're not afraid of her. They always think we we are because we run away. And and that was George. He likes most of the people here, even me, like to try to punch trees, and it's like we're ha it's like we're having a tug of war challenge with trees. <laughs> we making sure that I that we can get them back up so so the giraffe can reach it. He likes he likes to hang out around with me in lunch. We like to talk about stuff. He's one of my friends. Most of the fifth graders are my friends except for Cookie Deer and all those spoiled rich, rich girls. Or spoiled girls. Or, or mean girls. The boys all all think I'm the best girl in the class because everybody else because some of the other kids in class aren't really mean. I mean really are mean. That's that's fierce. He always likes to knock down those trees with us. He's like the best one in in the school. He can punch them with his claws, his head, his body, his feet. And and that is <sighs> what was her name again? Uh, uh, well, I'm 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 Jackson. Well, actually, my name is Jack Jackie. People, Jackie is my nickname. My real name is. Is Jack, but there's also another Jack in school, so my teacher just calls. Uh, so my teacher just calls me Jackie. Okay then, Jackie. Me, me and Jackie. Well, Jackie would always knock down trees by trying to eat their leaves. They would always fall down, but he would get into the hole of a tree. And pick it up and put it right down for for fierce to try to knock it down. Ugh. I always get my my snout stuck in it. <laughs> and that was Cookie Deer. She's the girl that thinks she's so rich because her parents owned all of all of the money. She always wants to to steal something because because to make her even richer to 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 tell people that that she had the money and not other people who owned the money. Those poor people having to witness her tricks. Oh, since all my parents are gone, I can just do a new thing because everybody will. A judge me for being that spoiled rich girl. That means I have to. That means I have to be somebody else. Somebody who isn't spoiled or mean, just evil. I have to find a master able to destroy their friends and family. So she won't have any parents too, and she'll feel like how it is to be bullied for not having parents. She'll regret. 
they'll regret it already. A few years later, after college, and after college, they have now all graduated. Except for Isabella, which was still trying to, to find where, where we lived now. Now she figures out. She's still... But now she bullies us for being in college and punches us even harder because now she's like in a different grade. So she kicks us. Everybody gets bullied a little. Then soon we're all going to move to a different town. Soon this place will be nothing but a piece of rock. What? I'm telling my parents that you said that. We can't because cause I am the boss of you because you are smaller. Fine. Is dark. Hey, Pony, you want to be in, in the job with me? You want to be? Sure. I'll run the thing for you. So, so we can look that straight away with little bit, little storms that will hurt them so much they, they will always notice. Those storms I have run for years. Tornadoes, oh yeah. All storms I control, all storms. I, I, I don't control the rain. The rain just comes here by, by itself and helps the little plants. Well, one time I did an acid storm. That must have hurt the little people in that town. Yeah, it didn't work well. That was in the back days of 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 the the other the wetlands, and now it all it is is nothing. That's all I can see. If I put another acid storm there, it's going to be a land that I can own. Well, you can just, well, you can put down the hills and make it our land. And then we can have a very spooky area. Just like the police in my dreams. Oh, I, I sure wish it was true in my dream. There was this place where you had to solve the code and figure out a mysterious land been left behind. That sounds like kind of awesome. Maybe we should should do that. Yeah. Sure. Miss Gerlo, something's very wrong in our town. What is it? We see some, somebody that looks familiar. Is it Cookie Deer? Yep, sure is. With, with the a leader of controlling storms? Soaring? And they're talking something about evil plans. We have to form a team together to do to do this all together. And we only needed one more member. I spotted it first. I was all the way 
up in my nest. All the way up there. And then I spotted something strange. And that was when I saw it. And then I called some people that, to help. Next I called, next I saw Fireball. Working near the volcano. I was just testing out my magic on the fireballs to make, to just give that fairy vibe. A dude, a fireball! Okay then, who's... And then I showed him where it was. And then I spotted... And then I spotted Jack. Chasing around Jackson. Actually, my name is Jack, and then he's Jackson. Oh, sorry. I got mixed up on your names. Hey, and I'm Jackie. Yep, yep, and then Jackie is here too. I guess Jack is just a really popular name here. Indeed. Now we need you to help us. We just need a plan to make it happen. Magic, magic. I think I know a place that has magic other than my lovely fireballs. Yay! Uh, we know fireball. So what is the place that they're talking about? Well, it's pretty close by. The unicorn lives around here. Unicorn you're talking about? Unicorns aren't real, you know that. No, in this land, anything can happen. See, the unicorn's here. Hello. I am magical. I am the god. Now, what do you all want? We need your help. Yes. Can we can we all have some some powers so so we can uh be a hero and save this land from from polluting and polluting and destruction? Yes. Your wish is command. Except for you, because because you're already magical, so yeet. Um, my tray, the tray. Okay. And because only you in the area will get to. Okay, we're ready. Me too. I need to get on your back. Is there a way I can get on your back? Terrible 